good morning ladies and gentlemen today's date is saturday june the 18th and the local time right now at denver international airport in the bathroom by my crew room is 4 20 a.m so yesterday the 17th and today are my days off and as per usual i did pick up a turn and guys i do want to tell you where i am going today I'm going from Denver to airport code MSN. MSN is Madison, Wisconsin. So it's a simple turn. So Denver to Madison, Madison back to Denver. Now let me tell you the specs for this turn. Uh, the time away from base, six hours and 58 minutes. Credit hours, four hours and 43 minutes. And for this turn, ladies and gentlemen, I am a very strong background singer. So my position, I am heard but not seen until I want to make my appearance. It's a simple turn because I start a four day reserve block as of tomorrow. So this is the look going to Madison, guys. Try to do something a little different with the eyeshadow. I am still rocking this wig. And I did order another wig from a company called, I think, Love Me. We're gonna see how this works out, but yes, I am saving money by buying this wig because again, I've had this since June the 5th. She's still going strong and the wig is still going strong. My check-in is 5, 10 a.m. I've already checked in. And guys, I have so much time on my hands. I have about 40 minutes. So I have a lot of time on my hands. I'm just gonna get my look together, go to my gate and wait. Unfortunately, Starbucks does not open to five and I have to go to the C concourse. My airline, we are in A. Not gonna risk it, I'll get something going back to the crash pad, because I should be back around 11.30. And all of this that I'm doing helps for that second check on the 20th. Now, I did get paid, and this check was very attractive, conceited, arrogant, cocky. The check was so beautiful, and I cannot wait to tell you guys about it. But with this check, I got bills to pay. So that's why I do this, ladies and gentlemen. So we will have a conversation later. Y'all know about my safety checks and pre-flight requirements because I tell you guys all the time that is something flight attendants have to do is to make sure the aircraft is safe and we all have sections we gotta check based on our position. So ladies and gentlemen, with that being said, we will have a conversation later, but yes, good morning. And y'all stay tuned. And ladies and gentlemen, I am on the aircraft. It is a A320 Space Flex. So 31 rows of seats, 186 passengers, max capacity. It's very empty because we are not boarding. Uh, it's just me and the crew on here. We've done our safety checks and pre-flight requirements. We have been catered, so that is half the battle. Now the next thing we're waiting for is the gate agent to mark us all here and proceed with boarding but it is hot because our uh, air is off, of course. But I like when the planes are cleaned because I know they cross the seat belts and crossing the seat belts just makes it look a little bit better. And if you don't know what I mean, this is what I mean. See how that seat belt is crossed? Every seat, that's how the seat belt looks. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so again, going to Madison, that would be my first leg and then coming back. So while I have this time to just woosa and be peaceful, I will take that moment to do that and I'll talk to you when I get to Madison. Good morning. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we arrived in Madison, Wisconsin. Uh, the local time right now is 9.26 a.m. Uh, so the flight time from Denver to Madison was an hour and 47 minutes. Now we are heading back again on a A320 space flex so we were three-fourths full first flight tired I never get enough rest so I just can't wait to get back to Denver and uh, take a very aggressive nap of course I need to stay up at least until one o'clock so I can bid for something if there is something for me to uh, bid for because tomorrow's our four-day reserve black but all right so we tidied up the aircraft and we are going to be boarding pretty soon so guys I'll see you in Denver <laughs> 